You could get a Nest Cam to monitor your house. You could buy a Wink Hub to control your smart home products, and you could get a bunch of different gizmos to make sure your kids are entertained. But none of those have a cute robot face. Buddy boasts all of those features and more, while serving as a great family companion for the elderly and kids. He recognizes you, reminds you of things, patrols your house, all with a beaming smile on his face. Hi, Buddy. Hello. Present yourself. My name is Buddy. I am the first companion robot destined to general public. You can adopt me right now on Indiegogo.com. What can you do? I can detect a flood, fires. I can dance, call family member, play music, and many other thing you will discover buying me. Do you know what Skynet is? Do you kn no problem. Do you know what Skynet is? Can you dance? <laughs> So tell me about the facial recognition. How does Buddy know who's who when he's talking to different family members? Yes, yeah, we work on this uh, because it's a real challenge to be able to recognize uh, uh, face. Mm -hmm. So it's easier to when it's in families because we just have to learn maybe 10 people and mm -hmm. the other one will be unknown by Buddy. And, and after we'll, we will try to work to be able to recognize a lot of people, but mm -hmm. it's not just only with uh, facial recognition, but with voice, too, voice recognition too. Yeah. Tell me a little bit about his uh, language processing and what kind of is powering that. We use uh, Android, uh, Google Now, uh, and Google recognition, voice recognition, mm -hmm. so we can recognize uh, English, French, and other, a lot of other language, and he can speak all this uh, language. Yeah. So it seems like Buddy's kind of an emotional little guy. How do, how do his kind of faces kind of change with the situations? Uh, if we want to uh, sell a robot and in each family in the world, mm -hmm. uh, the key point is uh, acceptability. To be accepted, the robot has to be cute, uh, small. Mm -hmm. We had we made a lot of studies before. And uh, to create a real uh, empathy, a real relationship with the robot, it's why we have this design, it's why we have this uh, face. But it's for families, mm -hmm. for children, for senior. Everybody thinks that uh, older people don't like robots, mm -hmm. but it's not true. Uh, they really like robots and they want to have some robots, but a small robots. Mm. So when the robot came to um, remind them to take their medicine, or, uh, they will do it because there is a, a real relation, a relationship mm. with the robots. Why did you decide to sell Buddy on Indiegogo? And tell me a little bit about the campaign, how it's been going. We like to have our feedback from our, our community, from mm -hmm. people uh, very soon. We can see uh, who buys these robots, mm -hmm. uh, for which application. So we yeah. have already sold 200 uh, developer edition because mm -hmm. a lot of people want to develop their own application on the robot because yeah. it's an open platform mm -hmm. and we, we use well-known tools like uh, Unity 3D. Okay. Everybody will be able to create their application mm -hmm. and distribute their application on Google Play because we use an Android tablet. So, okay. That was great talking to you. <laughs> Thank you.